Okay, so let's just jump right into the haul. The um, First, I'm going to start with the items that I got from Ulta. The first thing is this um, Black Girl Magic. Well, Black Girl Magic. Anyway, this Black Girl Sunscreen. Um, I use the original, but it just kind of has me a little oily, but I still use it anyway. Um, but I saw that she makes it in matte now. And so I went ahead and picked this up. And I can't wait to use it because, you know, I really like a matte look. And so when I saw that she had it in matte, I was like, I got to get my hands on it. So I did pick this up and it's broad spectrum SPF 45, which is pretty good as well. So, all right, next up is this God is a Woman by Ariana Grande. Um, this smells so good. It's kind of similar to the cloud, but it's not... I guess not as intense, but uh, yeah, I really like this one. I'm actually wearing that this today, so yeah, had to pick that up. Right. The next item I picked up was the um, YSL Illicit Green. Now, this I am first of all, I'm obsessed with YSL fragrances, I love black opium, but um, this Illicit Green it smells so so good i did um go back and get the um one ounce because i already have the bigger one i got that one when i had a 20 percent off coupon last month but i just had to go back and get the smaller one just so that i can kind of throw it in my purse if i want to take it with me but yeah i haven't even opened this one yet but um that's what i plan on using it for just to throw it in my bag in case i want to you know kind of do some touch-ups or if i happen to leave the house and forget my fragrance bam i got this right here in my bag i can't you know i mean you can't go wrong with this one but yeah i love this particular one like they did the thing when they did that and then on top of that my favorite color is green so yeah okay so next up i picked up a few oils this shea moisture body oil here this is really good i actually um got this from target when i first tried it and then i saw that um Ulta had it as well um they were had a little sale going on i can't remember exactly how much it was but it was enough that where it was cheaper than it was at target so i was like let me just go ahead and get another one just so that i can have it but it's a really good um body oil it, it you know hydrates it pretty good it doesn't leave me feeling greasy um but then again my skin like it kind of sucks up oil and moisture so yeah but anyway it's pretty um pretty good virgin coconut oil um body body oil that's you know softens and restores skin but i like it so all right and the next one i purchased was the fur oil um everybody knows all about this one i've been using it for quite some time now just for my um after waxes or whatever and so far it's been doing pretty good for me um it's kind of expensive i wish it was something <laughs> that was um you know comparable for a cheaper price but overall i would say it's it's worth it and that's why i try to normally get it when you know there's a sale going on or i have a coupon or something like that but i mean i was out of it so i needed to go pick up another one and then next up i also got another um oil which is a bio oil however it's a uh, dry skin gel it's for dry skin so it's more of a gel formula and i was very curious to try this out because i usually use gel moisturizers on my face during the in the summertime and so when i saw that they came out with this dry skin gel from bio oil i definitely wanted to try this out because their regular um oil i've been using that for years i would say um maybe six seven years now i've been using that and it's really good i mean it's I, the reason why I started using it, they were saying it was good for like stretch marks and things like that. And so I started using them for that. And over the years, you can tell that it fades them, but it doesn't actually get rid of them. But overall, you know, I don't have anything bad to say about it. I really like this, um, this brand Bio Oil. And the next item, I typically don't purchase these that often. Well, I, actually, I don't purchase these. Well, yeah, that often, and I don't purchase these to wear daily. I purchase them for special occasions, and it's the um, Kiss So Wispy Full Bouncy Volume and Curl Lashes. I'm not a big makeup girl, so if I, you know, know that I'm going somewhere or having an event or something to go to, then I'll actually just purchase, um, like, some lashes, and then, you know, I do wear 
um eyeshadow and sometimes i'll put on like a little bit of foundation something that's light i typically use the nars foundation or either the fenty um butter drop not butter drop girl that's something totally different the fenty um eavesdrop but yeah i also got a pack of the ardell naked lashes these look so cute and they look so lightweight and like something that i can you know get with But yeah, just picked up a few lashes and these will probably last me like a year or more because I, like I said, I don't typically get wear them that often. All right, and the next item or items that I picked up were some um, press-on nails. I can do my own acrylic nails, but I don't always have the time and I don't always want to put acrylic on my nails. So I'll like pick up some um, press-ons. I've been like wearing press-ons for years as well. But anyway... Um, these are the ba basically keep calm and stay classy nails by Kiss. And then I also picked up the, um, Kiss Gel Fantasy Collection. I thought both of these were so cute. Um, the slim, the pickings were kind of slim in the store. So, um, yeah, usually I get, you know, a couple of boxes of these but like i said their um nail shelf was kind of bare today and also you can um find these at target as well as walmart but like like i said since i was in ulta i just grabbed them all right and then the next item that i picked up was this um dr girl i don't even want to butcher this name seche vite I don't know, but it's a dry fast top coat. And this right here is the bomb. It's really good. It dries really fast. And I I'll actually use these for my toes. Like when I'm polishing my toes, I don't do gel on my toes. I just do regular polish. And sometimes I'm in a rush and I want to go ahead and get dry. I use this. And then I also have this spray that I purchased from Walmart that I use as well, which I'm out of at the moment. I need to go and pick up some more. But yeah, since I was in Ulta, I did grab this to use and then last but not least i got my birthday uh gift which is the mario mario badescu the um facial spray with aloe and coconut water i purchased this um let me see was it sephora i think it was sephora i purchased this from sephora um and the rose water and then the cucumber melon as well and both of them were pretty good like i don't know really what the use of it is other than to kind of refresh your face in the summertime and that's what i use it for so anyway um that concludes everything that i picked up from ulta so let's see what i got from sephora okay so the first item that i picked up from sephora is this idol idol hope i'm saying that correctly but it's by lancome it's the idol lash lash lifting volumizing mascara the reason why i picked up this one is um like i said that's usually all that i wear like on an everyday basis is just mascara and unless i'm going somewhere i'll pop on some lashes and some eye um eyeshadow but other than that i'm usually only wearing mascara and then i was hearing a lot of good things about this particular mascara and that it actually works so yeah i just wanted to give it a try for myself okay and the next items that i picked up were these two fragrances one by killian and the other by tom ford i actually got the um smaller versions because i want to test them out first to make sure i like them and i actually do i love them the first one is the apple brandy by killian this smells amazing i really like this perfume so i'm definitely going to purchase the um larger one and the second one is the tom ford uh soleil brulant this particular one it smells good but i'm just not crazy about it so i don't think i'll be purchasing the full bottle of this one um the, so far with tom ford the only ones that i'm really crazy about is the soleil neige as well as the um bitter peach i purchased the full bottle in both of those and i love them the only thing is the soleil neige it just doesn't really have staying power to me and the bitter peach mm, it's okay like sometimes like when i spray it i feel like by the middle of the day it's gone and sometimes when i spray it i feel like by the middle of the day like i can smell it just a little bit so anyway um you know it is what it is i still like those too and I, i'm gonna continue to wear them but yeah i'm definitely 
going to purchase the larger one of this apple brandy okay so next up i did end up purchasing some more um sunscreen besides the black girl sunscreen i really love super goop um i first heard about super goop when i was watching a youtube video by um shauna who is actually happy stylish mommy and she it was it was years ago actually well it might have been two years ago i'm not sure but anyway she mentioned um one of their sunscreens i'm not exactly sure which one it was but anyway since then i've been hooked the first one that i purchased is this super goop glow body screen this right here i already own this and i just had to get another bottle of it because it actually does give you like sort of a I don't know how to explain it. I should put some on for the video, but it's like this cute little glow that would be perfect for the summertime. I thought that when I first tried it, that it was gonna make me look all ashy as some sunscreens do, but it actually doesn't. It's really cute. And then I got the um, everyday lotion. And I love that this is SPF 50. The more the better, even though, you know, natural melanin helps to protect us from the sun, but still we need to wear our sunscreen. And then the next one, I've never tried this particular one before, but I saw that they had it. So I did get this. It's called the Super Goop Glow Oil because again, I love a good oil. So I'm so ready to try this. It has SPF 50 in it as well. Okay, and next I did get another body oil because like I said, I love body oil for some reason. Like it just does so much better for my skin than regular lotion does. So I tend to always want to try out different body oils. This particular one, I have not tried it out yet, but it's by Necessaire. And I heard that Necessaire is really good. Like I hear everybody always talking about Necessaire, this, Necessaire, that I do want to try their deodorant, but I didn't, they did not have it in stock. They had the eucalyptus, eucalyptus. And I actually wanted the fragrance free one. So they did not have that one in stock, but hopefully I'll be able to get my hands on it soon because I do um, wear natural deodorant. And I just wanted to try this one out because I saw a video from someone else that said that it was really good if you do happen to use natural deodorants. But anyway, I'm anxious to give this one a try. Next up, this particular item, I don't know. I just was looking at it, standing in line to check out. And I was like, you know what? Hey, it doesn't hurt to try it. It's the Ole Heinrichsen. I've heard that they have some really good skincare products. And this one is called a See Your Best Selfie. It's a brightening moisturizer and eye cream set. And I can, I mean, you can never go wrong with a good moisturizer. I would definitely um, want to try this out and see how it works. And with the eye cream, like I've been noticing that I've kind of been getting some like lines under here, which you know I am in my late 30s. But anyway, I mean, hey, it doesn't hurt to just try some things out to kind of stay youthful. But I'm definitely ready to try this one out and see how it works for me. All right, and next up, <clears throat> I got the Tatcha, the Dewy Skin Cream. I've never tried this particular one before. But I have tried the um, water cream from them, and I love it. Um, the water cream is so light, soft, and it has my skin feeling just so smooth and not too um, greasy or anything like that. And the reason why I ended up purchasing this one is because I was watching a video, and this girl compared it to Creme de la Mer. And I actually use Creme de la Mer. It's expensive as all get out, but... I use it and I was like, okay, wait a minute. She compared this to Creme de la Mer and then she actually said that she liked it better than the Creme de la Mer. So I was like, okay, if I can get this for like 60 bucks, well, 68 or whatever, and save all that money from using the other one, I think it's worth giving it a try. So I'm definitely going to try this out starting tonight when I do my skincare. But yeah, um, it comes in this cute little jar with a little spoon and everything on top it's just so cute and i was like you know what it, it doesn't hurt to try it hopefully it works as well for my skin as she was explaining but girl i, I was like you know what i'm gonna try it out <laughs> and then last but not least i got my birthday gift from sephora as well and of course i picked the tasha the uh dewy skincare cream with and this one comes with a rice wash so and i 
Oh, also it comes with the liquid silk canvas. I don't know what that is. I never heard of that one, but I'm definitely going to try that. But the rice wash, I heard some good things about that as well. So I'm really excited to try that. And then of course, if I like it, I'm going to go ahead and purchase the larger one in it as well. But yeah, overall, I feel like I got some pretty good things. Um, may not be as interesting as, um, you know, some other things that you may have seen out there, but it's just what I needed at the moment. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed with this video thank you so much for watching and if you have not subscribed i would love if you would join the rest of my subscribers and subscribe to my channel i do um lifestyle videos like i sometimes do nails i do a lot of shop with me videos because i love going to dollar tree five below tj maxx home goods target those are my jams so definitely stick around if you like watching those i um watching those things as well anyway thank you